We've all been there, struggling to find the perfect voiceover artist that fits in your budget, dealing with extensive recording studios, or spending hours editing audio files. But what if I told you that there's a way to create professional sounding voiceovers in your own voice with just a few clicks. Technology is advancing so quickly and it is absolutely crazy what you can do. I'm gonna show you step-by-step step how to create a voiceover in your own voice, whether it be for creating content like a podcast episode or an audiobook, or even for common business tasks like marketing campaigns and customer service. So here's how this will work. First, I'm gonna show you the best text-to-speech software in the biz, and then we will brainstorm some ways that you can use it to make your life easier. By the end of this video, you will be well on your way to saving yourself time and money when it comes to creating audio content. This is Riverside. Riverside is an online conversation studio that's perfect for recording and editing high quality audio and video content. Riverside also has a top of the line text to speech generator. So you would sign up for an account and log in. Then you would create a new studio with this plus button. You would name your studio and select create. I've already created one for this process called AI voiceovers. Then you're gonna head up to this AI voice button. You will have had to record in Riverside at least once before so that the platform can regenerate your voice. Riverside will prompt you to record a short script if you haven't already recorded. Once you've done that, paste the text that you need a voiceover for in the box here. Select generate AI voice. Then when it's processed and ready, you can listen to it. Select it. Riverside is the perfect solution for content creators and businesses who need to generate high quality content. It's perfect for podcasts, talking head videos, marketing videos, webinars, and presentations. And if you need help learning how to use Riverside, check out the Riverside YouTube channel where me and Steven will help you with all things Riverside. Okay, that is scary accurate. So on this page, if you scroll down, you can download that high quality audio file right here. You can also head into the editor. So in the editor, you can do a few things. With this AI producer button, you'll see a set paste feature. If your audio file were to come out with some silences that you want taken out of the audio file, you can take out as much or as little silence from your recording as you'd like. You'll see here when I press apply, it's taken out all of those little silences along the timeline here. With this add button, you can also add more AI voice. So maybe you want to add a second section. You would just press AI voice and convert your text to speech again. Now, if you wanted to turn this into a video, maybe you want to turn it into an audiogram, you would head up to this menu at the top, select which aspect ratio you'd like your video to be, and you'll see a canvas appear. And here you can design an audiogram directly in Riverside so that you have a video file to go along with your AI voice. If you wanna learn more about creating audiograms in Riverside, you can head to the video linked above. Now, what if you already recorded something? Say you recorded it on Riverside and you need to insert another section within that recording. No problem. In the video that you recorded, head into the editor, and you'll see that you'll have the option to add sections using this text-based editor. So you would simply select add wherever you'd like to add content within your episode or your video, select AI voice, and then you would add what you want your AI voice to say. You'll see that that AI voice will start generating and be inserted directly into your content. If you wanna move it around within your content, you can easily click and drag it to wherever you'd like. So, because I know you'll ask, no, you cannot generate speech in other people's voices. The speech will only be generated in the host of the account's voice. So we're only working with your voice here. Now, yes, this is AI. Some people love it, some people hate it, but we're only using this for good, okay? Let's go through some ways that creatives and businesses can use this tool. We're gonna look over 10 everyday tasks that can be completed in seconds with Riverside's text-to-speech. Create consistent professional sounding intros and outros for your podcast episodes. So you can update your templated introduction with episode titles and guest names and guest social handles for every single episode without recording a thing. Welcome back to Talking 20 Podcast, the show where we talk all about navigating your 20s in the digital age. You're listening to episode 10 with our guest, Stephen Robles, you can find him on the Riverside YouTube channel teaching about all things video and audio content creation. Speaking of podcasts, maybe you have to record a sponsored ad. You can do that in no time now. 
If you're a content creator and you need to create content in a fraction of the time, I am going to tell you about the perfect tool that will save you both time and money. Do you have a book? Why not turn it into an audiobook narrated by you with little effort on your part? Once upon a time in a land far, far away lived a girl named Bridget. Explainer videos are super time consuming to record, but not with help from AI. Generate your visuals on a platform like Biteable and then use text to speech for the voiceover. Step one to recording high quality content is to purchase a high quality microphone. My vet's office always changes their voicemail literally every single day. So what if they could just insert their templated message, rewrite the date, and generate that voicemail? You've reached your favorite vet office. Today is Friday, August 30th, 2024. Please leave your name in a brief message and we will get back to you as soon as we can. Boom. Or maybe you always need to update your phone menus. Now you can just whip up new menu items in no time. Thanks for calling Riverside. Please enter the extension of the person you are trying to reach or press one to hear the directory. What about creating teaching material? You can effortlessly create audio components for your online courses, saving time and energy for the more important aspects of course creation. I hear you want more information on chapter two. Let's dive a little deeper into the equipment you'll need to start a podcast. Repurpose your blog posts into audio podcast episodes or even YouTube videos. Sounds pretty cool, right? Video content consumption is on the rise. Here are 10 reasons why you need to start adding video to your podcasts. I've made a video walking you through that process, which I'll link above. Do you have a last minute event that you need to advertise? You can rapidly produce audio announcements for events, conferences, or meetups. Make sure to come visit the Riverside booth at Podcast Movement to say hi to the team and hear about some secret upcoming features. If you do a lot of presentations, you can quickly generate a voiceover for each slide, highlighting the key features and benefits. This way, your presentation becomes more engaging and you can focus on perfecting your visual content. The 10 episode rule is how you can decide if you should dive head on into podcasting. If you can come up with topics for 10 strong episode ideas, you have a good start. Can you think of any more ways that you can use text to speech? Let's brainstorm together in the comments. Don't let outdated methods hold you back. Embrace the future of content creation. It's all about working smarter, not harder. If you wanna stay up to date with the advances in video and audio technology, make sure to subscribe to this channel and we'll keep you informed with the latest trends and workflows for video and audio content creation. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments. I answer those personally. And if you liked this video, I would love to know. So make sure you give it a thumbs up before you go. If you wanna learn more about Riverside and what you can do with it, I'll leave a playlist of videos here for you to binge. Thanks for hanging out with me. My name is Bridget O'Rourke, and I'll see you next week.